I've got a portable spot where we've got seams to come with all the things you need. We've got some pretty high quality terminals. We've got some tin. We've got a file from the terminals, USB-C charger, and the unit itself. It's Kerpu branded. It has buttons there to change uh, the mode and how much current. There's an unknown button at the top near the charger. And you can see here it's got the ratings on the back. Here we have automatic or manual mode. You can see the battery percentage and we've got six different gears. When I said tin, I meant nickel. And you can see in automatic mode, it welds. Just went to town with some welding until the bloody probes are too hot to hold. There's a slight gap in the case there. Let's have a look. All right, that took a lot of effort and that is not going to go back together anytime soon. These bastards were glued down and I can't express to you how much it scared the shit out of me to remove them. And here's the controller board. I also had to use an impact driver to take those battery channels off. Well, I couldn't find anything about those batteries online from the few little codes that are there. So I'm going to attempt to put this back together now without I put it back together and it still works and I didn't release the magic smoke nor did I visit heaven But I can confidently say I never want to do that again and you should never try But for 50 bucks or something, this thing is awesome Oh, it's got to be a trigger button for manual mode Got it 